hello Capricorn thank you so much for coming back to my channel if you are new hello I am Yasmin if you have not already please like and subscribe all right Capricorn I'm going to go ahead and do a love reading for you I did not do a regular read so I'm going to try to get that done tomorrow but I'm going to go ahead and do a love reading we're going to see what comes out so we're going to see if there's any interference. I'm going to use the Love Triangle Oracle. We're going to see what comes out in this reading here for you, Capricorn. So let's get it. Let's see what comes out here for Capricorn. Okay. <clears throat> Capricorn, we know you've been stuck on people or someone, right? We know that you've been you know, stuck on someone for a while. At the bottom of the deck, it's I'm trash. Ooh, sounds about right, okay. It says someone, it says once a cheater, always a cheater, okay. Um, and that's what I feel, because we've been seeing that in your readings where someone has been mistreating you, that type of thing. But anyway, let's go ahead. That's at the bottom of the deck. Let's get to some good ones here. So let me see. Oh, you got some really, really good cards here. Okay, so I'm going to start with this one first. So here you have a card that talks about someone being caught in the act. And I, I really do feel that way because this is the reason why you feel that someone is trash. Okay, it could have been through the internet. You could have been going through someone's phone or you heard someone's conversation. Whatever it is, you found out that someone was dealing with another person. Now, that may have thrown you off, so let's just say, you know, you, you were just so affected by it, you weren't really taking care of yourself, you, you know, you couldn't eat, you couldn't sleep. This is going to be a good time for you to take care of you, putting yourself first, bringing balance back into your life, because if this is trash, what, what happens with trash? It gets taken out, it's, you know, you don't bring it back in your house, it's out for good, okay? I feel like when you do take this time, to focus on yourself, you're going to get clarity here. It says, you know, mental clarity, getting rid of the distractions and the trash and gaining a new perspective. So I really do see really good things here. I can't wait to show you what just fell out. So look at how this, look at what happened. So it's like, this was devastating. A lot of you found out that there was someone else, even if you didn't catch anyone. This is just like an example. Even if you didn't catch anyone, you found out that your person was dealing with another person and they, you know, they could have started treating you, you know, pushing you to the side. They weren't talking to you, you know, uh, any, any little thing, you know, microaggressions, all types of stuff. And then it seems like that meant to happen to pull you in a new direction. Why? Because here it talks about a love bond. There is going to be some kind of love that's going to come in here. Now, I do feel like for some of you, your person is in love with someone from the past. They're still in love with their person that they were with from the past. And it says that they're not going to leave them to be with you. Okay. And this is not to be mean. I feel like this is the conversation that you may have had. Okay. It talks about heart to heart conversation. Okay. Okay. Um, but this is what I'm saying here. Someone who's going to come in and be madly in love with you. All right. So again, I feel like there is going to be a love bond that you're going to create with someone new, but I really do feel like your person is not going to leave their person for anyone. They, this could be like a rebound situation, that type of thing. And this is the reason why there's anger. Okay. Why you feel like, okay. You know, they could have been screaming like you're, you could have actually said they're trash. But I just feel like this was, you know, possibly they were dealing with you just to get their mind off of their person or to maybe to get back at their person. It could be that type of thing. Let's go ahead. Let's keep going. This is going to be for Capricorn. Last two. Thank you. I have apology. So someone will come in and apologize to you. OK, and this doesn't mean that you're going to be with them. I just feel like for some of you, you know, of course, this is a general, so it's not going to be for everyone. Not everyone is dealing with someone from the past. So I do feel like for some of you, there will be someone that's going to come in and apologize for what they've done. And this is going to give you some type of closure. And here with workplace affair, fooling around at work, using work as an excuse, that type of thing. I mean, I see a lot of crappy things in this reading. Ah, this deck is kind of exhausting. Exactly. It's kind of exhausting. Um, because you see too many scenarios. You see that someone is definitely with someone else. Now, if you're having an affair with your person at work, 
they're not going to leave their person for you. That's exactly what this looks like. They're just not, okay? But you are going to develop a love bond with someone else, someone that's going to be madly in love with you, okay? And for some of you, this is someone from your past, okay? Because like I said, this is a general reading. So I do feel communication. Even here with this clarity, that's like the Ace of Swords card. So there is going to be communication coming in, that type of stuff is what I'm saying. Heart to heart conversation, same thing, communication that's going to come in. Um, but for others, this literally is just like, you know, I'm just having an affair. I'm not, I have no intention on leaving my spouse or my, my person for you. Okay. I mean, it, it, and this could have, they could have said it just as blatantly as that. Okay. They could have made you feel something completely different in the beginning. So what we're going to do is use some of these tarot cards here. We're going to see how this is going to play a role in your reading. So this is going to be for Capricorn. Let's see. Look at this first card that came out. You have new love here. And this person is going to be in love with you. But you have to get rid of this emotional baggage. You have to. And I don't know if this is, you're holding on to it out of ego. Maybe you just really felt hurt or you can't believe that this person actually did this to you. Now, this is like the brutal honest truth, right? It's like, you know, it's hard to hear, but this is what this person was pretty much saying. Um, and I'm pretty sure that this person didn't just do this with you. They've, they've probably done this to other people and you just got caught in the cycle, okay? But the university that you have gone through this, this was a lesson I'm pretty sure that was learned out of this. But you have love coming in. Someone that's going to, that, that is really going to open up to you. Um, someone that's going to just be in love, okay? Be open and be in love with you. And you're going to fall in love with yourself as well. And I think that's what's needed. Look at this. This is soon someone is going to come in here. Got emperor at the bottom of the deck. This is how I know this is going to be a connection that is going to be everything. This is amazing. For some of you, this is somebody from your past that is not in a long-term committed relationship. I just feel like maybe this person was running and they really do have feelings for you. They think about you a lot. Okay, and for others, this is someone new. And either way, you're not missing. This is really, really good. This is for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn. Thank you. So, yeah, someone wants to make peace with you here with the Six of Swords. Okay, they are frustrated that you are not together, that you you have time apart. You know, it's, it is just a bit of frustration is what I'm seeing on this person's end. Okay. Um, so if you're at a distance, this person looks like they will come in and visit you. I feel like this could be driving for some of you flying. So this person will see you face to face to make this apology. And they, and this person possibly could have a rose or flowers to, uh, schmooze you, I guess in a way. Okay. Let's go ahead. Let's keep going. This is for Capricorn. Capricorn got two cards here so look at this you have to walk away in order to get your two of cups because you are a lot of you are in a connection with someone because you want it so bad look at this five of cups it's even showing even at the bottom of the deck so you really fell in love a lot of you fell in love with someone who was just not they were not going to ever leave their person I feel like they were lying to you anyway but this is good because you got the Two of Cups and the Ace of Cups. Even though you are in this Five of Cups energy, feeling sad, drained, you know, regret, disappointment. Again, like I said, there is going to be a connection to come in here. So how can I put it? It is not all bad, even though you are feeling bad and down right now. Okay. Um, I just don't, this person just wasn't honest with you at all. And they really needed to be honest. Okay, and I think even though there's disappointed disappointment, just know that there's someone that's going to come in and love you the right way. Okay, I feel like you are exhausted from trying, thinking about it. That's what I feel. And there is going to be a soulmate connection or a spiritual connection here with that love bond. Let's get the last two cards here for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn. I think you're angry. Capricorn, a lot of you are angry with that devil card. 
Yeah, but you are still holding on to hope. Now, this is that, you know, get rid of any obsessions, though, okay? <laughs> this is part of breaking free. That nine of pentacles talks about being free. Break free. Love yourself. Allow this love to come in. The universe has not forgot about you here with the star card. I see nothing but good things here. But I do see a brutal, hard truth with what this person has done and what you have to realize yourself. But this is what I see here for you, Capricorn. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And again, if you are new, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you later. Bye.